welcome to Spartan Media News. My name is David. And I am Lee, and today is September 9th, 2016. We will start off with sports and football. This week, the football team had its media day, and we will be putting together some of the interviews and photos from that day as we follow the team this season. We had a chance to use the drone during passing drills and to meet the players. We will have our first football game this Friday versus Amador. Amador comes in 2-0. And we lost a tough one last week in the look opener and look to rebound this week against the Buffaloes. Switching to technology news, the new iPhone 7 is the next generation smartphone from Apple and is getting mixed reviews. It does come with an upgrade camera. It's water resistant. Not waterproof. And they removed the headphone jack. So you need wireless headphones or Apple's new AirPods, but they are so small and only $159. But what about the Samsung Galaxy Note 7? There were reports of the battery in the unibody device to explode, so they delayed the release of the, Note, of the new Note 7. Oh, Back to School Night, also known as Spartan Showcase, is on September 28th at 5 p.m. if you want to come down and have fun. Teacher and students will be sharing projects and giving parents and family an opportunity to get to know Spar uh, San Juan better. In world news, it has been reported that Syrian government attacked citizens with chlorine attack and killed two citizens that left multiple in the hospital with breathing problems. Yeah, supposedly 80 people checked into the hospital with, uh, with respiratory problems in the city of Aleppo. Citizens then accused the Syrian president Bashar Assad and launched the chemical weapon in the first place. Hey, do you know what's new in drama with Mr. Stommel? Um, not really. What are they up to? Hi, I'm Noah Castaneda reporting from San Juan here with San Juan's drama teacher, Mr. Stommel. Hey, how you doing? Good. Um, what can students or incoming freshmen expect from your drama class? Well, we have uh, an exciting program here at San Juan High School. Uh, we have an amazing auditorium. Um, and then here is our uh, acting studio. Uh, and uh, in the classes, freshmen uh, and anybody who comes to our beginning drama classes can expect to learn basic skills in acting techniques, uh, learning things about improvisation or improv, uh, pantomime and uh, one acts and scene work working with actually written scripts uh, we will do also some uh, playwriting in here as well very nice um, why did you choose to start teaching drama uh, I've been involved in theater as an actor a director and playwright for going on almost 40 years now so uh, ever since when I was in school uh, I started out as a performer and then moved into writing and directing uh, it's been a part of my life and I want to bring uh, what I have and my passion for drama and theater arts to uh, students here at San Juan very nice um, could you what made you choose San Juan as a school and not other schools I chose San Juan particularly because uh, is an, it's an established high school within this community. Uh, it's been here for over 100 years. It uh, has an amazing facility. Uh, the staff here at San Juan uh, care about the students, and you can tell when you talk to them and ask them about their day uh, or about what they do. There's a lot of pride in our staff here. Uh, being a teacher here at San Juan High School. And also, the students are amazing. Um, this is their home away from home. And uh, that's really a, uh, an exciting uh, place to work in. OK. Thank you for your time, Mr. Stommel. Thank you. Good luck to you. Back to you. That's good to hear from Mr. Stommel. Finally, a quick check of weather. Weather Underground is predicting a cool nice off next week and next a return to the lower 90s you might have noticed the days are sh getting shorter as sunsets now are around 7:20 in the evening as we move into fall well that's all for today everyone see you later bye